In 2021, I had a near-death experience where I crossed over the other side for 13 minutes, and this is something that I learned. So you want the hot body, the Maserati, the Lamborghini, you better shadow work, bitch. <laughs> you know, a lot of us are out here trying to manifest the life of our dreams. And a misconception, I think, is that we're told that we need to vibrate higher, to go hug a tree, and take ayahuasca to get the Lamborghini. But when I had this near-death experience, I had to sit through some of the most discomfort I've ever felt. A panoramic review of my life, what the Bible would call judgment. It was cringe. It was cringe because there's a lot of stuff I don't look at. I don't even want to see, I don't want to feel within myself. Density, darkness, beliefs, experiences that are keeping me from being and doing and having what I desire. So instead of listening to Abraham Hicks and The Secret and taking plant medicine, to try to raise my vibration, to create more power. I realized that the key all along was to sit with that stuff, accept the things that are hard to accept about myself. These quirks are what are weighing us down vibrationally. So to create lightness and buoyancy in those creates congruency so we can embody what we desire. And I think that's what they call shadow work. I just never fucking understood what that meant.